All right, not feeling the weekly too much in Super Auto Pets, so we're jumping over to Dicey Dungeons for a second. Uh, we're in pursuit of an alchemist with a bear potion. That's all I'll give you right now. We're going to jump into more of it in the game. But I want to remind you, this Saturday, we got two live streams. Bring your A-game. You could very well win your own brand spanking new Super Auto Pets pack. Hope to see you there. For now, let's check out the Dicey Dungeons. So a little recap on what we're trying to do here. I have been informed that there's a way to be a bear. Okay, you can be a bear in Dicey Dungeons, but you can't start as one. What you have to do is you have to play the thief. You have to go against an alchemist who has a potion that turns him into a bear. Well, the thief has an ability just innately that you can steal an enemy's equipment. That's why we have a ray gun right now. So we're going to try to find an alchemist. Um, I tried this a bunch of times. Anyone trying to become a bear out there? Uh, don't do it on Thief Episode 2. I did it like 10 times, and I, then I found out that you don't run into Alchemist there anymore. <laughs> I say anymore, I don't think you ever were able to, but yeah. So, in case you're going to try to become a bear yourself, don't do it on Episode 2. I don't know why it's a thing. Ooh, ooh hold on. Level 2 Alchemist. One second. Hold that thought. So... Here's the play. So we're going to get a random equipment from the alchemist every turn. In this case, we got fire potion, unfortunately. So that's not going to help us too much. But hopefully, let's see, he actually <laughs> he can't afford anything. So it's not going to reduce our chances at all. We got spiky potion. I mean, we might as well just do this, right? Cue it up, get him real close. He can use a spiky potion here. Hopefully we get bear, otherwise we'll just pass. We just got the fire potion. Okay, we'll, we'll get him like super low, and then we'll hope that he gets the, the bear, or that we get the bear next turn. Anything? There it is. Okay, it took a little while, but we're here. So... The bear is going to heal us up almost to full. And yeah, so the bear has a pretty basic kit, all things considered. I love his little appearance here. <laughs> um, oh, interesting. So you can't buy anything. I wonder why. Okay, so bear is not able to purchase anything from stores, I suppose. But yeah, all we have is bear malt. So you just use some dice. You deal two extra damage on top of whatever you rolled, and that's it. So, and then our, our bear smash down here is deal 10 damage. Not super exciting. Fortunately, we take out the wizard here. We got a good roll, turn one, so we can just kind of cook it up here. Repeat next action might be good. Marmalade. I could see it being useful in a, in a pinch, perhaps. Like, you roll a 1, you really don't want a 1, if you're the bear. Like, we can guarantee a 6 next turn, I guess is fine. 10 seems like a lot to have a repeat. Oh, we got a pretty good roll there. Um, okay, we got the 6. We're not going to be able to take him out here. Um, actually, we have bear smash. Yeah, we're good. All good. I'm glad we did, because we did not have much going on for us there. And who cares about the extra health, honestly. We're going to level up in two turns. I'm not worried about clearing out these early guys. Because we got Bear Maul out here. We're just mauling. <laughs> it's a good time. Okay, he did get doubles, but he did not get six doubles. So we take three. Um... This is not quite going to be enough, but next turn will be. Let's just hope he doesn't get big doubles. Okay, good. So he's going to get six more damage. Again, like not even remotely an issue. We're good. Bear Maul here. I'm, I'm very curious what kind of equipments the bear can acquire. Bear Trap, sure. Um... Probably better than the marmalade, right? I'd rather lock a die than just get some arbitrary, you know, throw a six on next turn kind of thing. 
I'd rather they don't hurt me. We did get the one. This is a pretty solid roll, actually. I think there's an argument for actually just getting rid of the the repeat action, whichever one that's called. What is it, bear charge? Because 10 is just way too much. When you only have three dice, 10 is just not gonna happen. So we got a nice easy win here. Take him out with the, the 10 damage bear smash or whatever it is. Mm. I mean, what is this? Okay, so this turns into five on the bear charge. I think that that makes it much more playable. You know, you roll a five, six, six or something and you're just golden. Ooh, we have four dice now, that's huge. Um, I think we do it like this. We don't have a one anyways for the bear trap. So let's just do a bunch of damage. Yeah, four and five. It's whatever. <laughs> it's whatever, I don't care. Um, let's do... Yeah, this one's kind of tough. So we could do... I want to lock his die. So maybe we just run it like this. Oh, actually, we, I think we could have killed him there. If we had put the one on the other one instead, that would have killed him. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. Could have got him just barely. We got some healing. No worries. Alright, now this is where it tends to start getting a little tricky. Once you get to floor four, they the enemies start to get pretty strong, and we don't have any sustain. So, aside from level ups, refreshing health, we got nothing. Yeah, we're gonna have to be a little, a little careful. But as you can see, we're doing a ton of damage still. 30 damage in one turn. Okay, he only got one. Huge. We only took two damage. Hell yeah. Yeah, get a hell yeah. Wicker man, huh? We also don't have any fire equipment either. That's gonna be a bit of a, a bummer. Now that is not a bummer, I'll tell you that much. So we just go here, double sixes, and then bring down the bear charge a smidgen. Just a tad. We got four. Not a problem. I don't think there's any way we kill him this turn. Let's see. Yeah, not quite. We were close. Five damage off. What has he got? No sixes. That's great. Can't get to 11 either. Even better. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. The bear is feeling good. The bear ain't too shabby. What else we got? Bear swipe. Okay. Um, I'm, yeah, I think we get rid of the bear mall here. Since we have the repeat, we can pretty effectively use the bear mall on the repeat and we won't need two of them. And what do we got here? Okay, we can lock here. Air swipe is kind of nice, it's just some free damage. Okay. Um, yeah, we locked a one. That's not amazing. <laughs> it's not the best thing ever. Okay. Oh, gosh. We're blind on two of them. Okay, neither of them are ones. Um, I guess we check for... Okay. How much damage did that do? I didn't even see. <laughs> I wasn't looking. Okay, so unfortunately, <laughs> the issue with the, the one requirements is we don't have any. So, they chose for the blind instead of another attack, which is very good for us. Okay, we win. Fantastic news. And we get the level up. Ooh, upgrade. Interesting. So I think bear mall is, is a good option because we can do the bear charge. 
Bear Trap, though, upgrade makes it more consistent. So does Marmalade. Um, yeah, I think we just Bear Maul, because that's going to be the one that we replay most of the time. Pretty much all the time, if we can help it. Weak to Fire, does not matter. Ooh, we got two ones. That's fantastic. Uh, so we can use Bear Swipe. We can use both of our one, one homies. And, oh, this just lined up perfectly, didn't it? This body just lined up perfectly. We got a five and a three. Not ideal, but... Half of our dice are gonna be ones. We still get our other six from Marmalade. So deal three. I mean, in some ways, having extra ones is actually kind of good for us. And then, yeah, let's just lock a die. Locked a one. I guess technically that matters a little bit, but it doesn't at the same time. <laughs> it really doesn't. Alright, we got three ones. Doesn't matter. Okay. Again, I'm a little worried about the health total. Of course, we do have options. Another bear swipe. That's tough. Um, we do have apples if we need to, to get our health up, but that's this bit pretty much all we got. Okay, bear trap. I wish bear trap would have two uses instead of just making it easier to use. But we'll take it. Throw in the second bear swipe. If you get a three, that's just three free damage. Okay, so... So yeah, we basically want to grab all the apples that we need. Because we have to kill all three of these guys in order to level up. What do we got? So Insta Bear Smash. We can go Bear Swipes, Bear Trap, and then we do this. Now that, hold on, that was a clean turn. Hold on. Y'all can't even deny it. Okay, he did get it an even. Which is expected. Ooh. Do it again. <laughs> Do it again. We go bear charge, we go bear maul. He a goner. Homie is just a goner. So yeah, we want to grab both apples. Since we have literally zero way to heal at all. It's just impossible. Mm, we got the threes. For the bear swipes. Repeat. We get a f nine times two. No one or two. Okay. Two damage is good. Cursed, not good. Let's just kind of hope that the bear charge, bear mall combo doesn't get smacked up. Oh baby, that's perfect. We could have killed him if we weren't cursed, but seven damage is not too bad. Bear swipe, bear swipe. Watch all three of them get blown up. <laughs> that would be terrible, but I wouldn't doubt it. All right, dire wolf. Direwolf can be very hit or miss, so hopefully... Oh, we actually have a fantastic start here. It does not get a whole lot better than this. We almost just one turn shot him. Okay, clean turn. Got all of our equipment off. Doesn't have any curse availability. Can only use one poison. We're good. This is the kind of situation where the bear needs some sort of healing, you know? We need like a honey ability or something. <laughs> Some way that we can heal a little bit. That's fine. We're back to full. Maybe we don't need it after all. Maybe that'd make the bear too good. I don't know. It's hard to say. Um, do we care about marmalade? I'm thinking probably not. I think bear swipe is fine. Let's just take out the jester. And <laughs> kill him with a bear. 
I wish I didn't have to stop you. Yeah, right. That's what they all say. Okay, another clean turn coming up. Another 20 damage. So he gets to inflict Confuse, which is actually kind of a fun ability. So you mix up your equipment and all the names and stuff, but you can still see the conditionals, right? So we, we still know what they all do, you just have to remember. <laughs> so it's kind of a fun ability. You know, you gotta kind of keep it in mind. You gotta understand your equipment, really feel what, what each of them do. Inherently, innately, maybe would be a good word. Okay, he's, he's locking two of our five dice. But we got a fantastic roll, so we're good. Easiest jester fight ever, question mark? <laughs> Not too bad. The bear doesn't feel broken, though. I will say, I feel like the bear is not that strong. I think the, the thief itself probably would. Is he coming with us? Did he just say he's joining our team? What's going on here? Yeah, who's- am I spinning the wheel? Do I have to take over for the jester? <laughs> what is going on? Hold on, okay. So we beat the thief episode that we had already beaten. Oh, Jester's joining the fight. Okay, <laughs> very interesting. All right, so the Jester is a new playable character. 